what's up you checking out the frequent flyer and i just wanted to do a quick little run with this ztx 10 by zd racing definitely one of my favorites this was my favorite of my uh ground vehicles before my 1 8 scale uh pirates 2 showed up <laughs> and so this thing really awesome i did do a few mods to it this here came from another ZD Racing 1 10th scale. This uh, crash bar on the front. I have a crash bar on the back. This is a stadium truck that didn't come with these uh, crash bars on it. So that's a little mod that I did. Let me show you guys under the hood. Had a lot of crashes with it and it's holding up. Um, one thing that did happen, I it said this is this is said to be waterproof, this ESC and all, but I did have a problem with my ESC smoking on me and I was driving it in some rain and it went in the pud puddle. I, I'm not sure if it submerged. I had my son driving it too. He might've submerged it for a quick few seconds or something. But anyhow, my last ESC did smoke. And so this is the ESC out of my other one tenth scale same size and all i believe this is a 45 amp esc i think that's what it is here i am looking to upgrade this esc i do run 3s on this this comes this comes 2s um rated and i just threw a, a 3s battery on it and started running it with 3s now i've been running it with this 3s right here i'm going to try to run it with this little small 1300 milliamp hour 3s pack here it's been modded a little i think this was initially a 4s pack and i lost the cell and so i just started using it as a three cell and so i have this little adapter on here so i can run it off the xt60 and i did have a problem with the on and off switch these on and off switches that come with these ZD Racing 1 10th scale trucks, they're garbage. They always stop working. And so I added this little switch here. It's more like a transmitter switch, like a trainer switch. But I added that on. Let me spin it around here so you guys can see over here. I just soldered it to the appropriate connections. Put some hot glue over it here so it's not going to short on anything. And I got these two capacitors just zip tied right up close to it. And I have some CA glue, some super glue on this thing, fasten it, fastening it to the frame. So it's not going anywhere. So I think that's all the mods I did to it. Yep, I think this truck might come in a newer version at least one of the ZD Racing 1 10th scale vehicles do come with an upgraded uh, chassis on the bottom. It's metal, but I have the older one and it's plastic. A lot of people have had a lot of problems with this thing, but it's been running like a champ for the most part for me. Definitely was my favorite ground vehicle before I got the Pirates 2 1 8th scale. So, uh... I'm just going to run it and show you guys how nice it runs. I did, let's see, did I? No, I didn't lock the diffs here. I didn't lock the diffs on this one. I'm planning to do that next. This is probably my last run without lock, having the uh, diffs locked there in the rear. I'm, I'm only going to, I think I'm only going to lock the rear. Let me stop running my mouth about this thing and show you guys how it runs. Hopefully this 3S pack holds up because the last time I was driving it, I was bashing it pretty hard and doing some speed runs. And I don't think that uh, LiPo is built for this extreme uh, bashing with these ground vehicles. And so it did swell up pretty bad, but it went down and it did hold the charge. So I'm hoping that it's still okay. Oh, looking like that battery is pretty much done. <laughs>
thing. Let's get a good 3S pack in this thing. All right, y'all, so I did manage to find another 3S to stick in here. It's only an 850 milliamp hour, and it's on an XT30 adapter, so it's not gonna be giving a bunch of throttle to this thing and all. And I'm not gonna run it long. Don't wanna kill a pack. Don't wanna kill a pack. Now let's see if we can get this thing popping willies like it does on 3S. Mainly what I wanted to show you guys, how much more kick it gets, how much faster it is. Let's see if we can. I don't think it's enough traction out here. Definitely a lot faster though, check it out. Do a speed run, speed pass. <laughs> and if it wasn't so dusty out here, it would probably do well, definitely would do some wheelies and all on the side alley. There, I can get a few these wheelies. try it. <laughs> you can see it wants to lift up. Let's see if we can do it to lift up. Nope. <laughs> Not enough traction. Kill this pack here. As you can see it's pretty fast. My ZD racing. Thunder ZTX-10. Thanks for watching. Nope, it's a graphene pack. This is what I was running it on. A little warm, not too hot. I took it easy on it. Thanks for watching.